car owes me four twenty to ten dollars. Yellow Jack says they did not. That's why you owe me ten dollars. I got. Hey, I respect it. I respect it. I like that. That's that funny. Is funny. I didn't even know I had that, that, is that in there. I'm ready, honey. Hey, 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 hey. It's been a very long time. We're back. We I'm so back. excited to see you. Sorry for yelling. We're I'm back. happy to be here. I miss you guys. We haven't been able to sit down and make a video for a very long time. We've been behind the scenes. Yeah, D a video in a live. I'm doing this kind of live. We can touch on the subjects here here for a bit. It's like three something. And then we're going to going to go live with the people. Okay. Right? And then, you know what I mean? So we'll be wearing the same thing. So don't be judging us whenever you be seeing us in the same stuff. Nobody judges us. Yeah, they be judging. Us. They, be, no, they, they be low key I judging. I no. Yeah, so we're gonna, what we're gonna do is we're gonna talk about these kind of, we're gonna talk about these quick subjects that are going on with the company. We've had some major changes. And then we're gonna get on live and actually interact with the people so that you guys can ask us live about the changes. If you've noticed any differences within the company, uh, the future of the company and stuff like that. Cause I know you guys have been seeing a lot of new content. Yeah, so, with businesses, supporting yes. our local businesses, going on location. Yes. So it's a little different content, but we still have our Flash Custom Transfers. We're still behind the scenes creating and making that business just as um, amazing. Yeah, just as amazing. So mm -hmm. I guess the first piece we're going to touch on is UPS, and I know you wanted to. This is your passion project with uh, UPS, so go ahead. Okay, my peep Flash fam, I love you all so much. I appreciate each one of you guys' orders, local pickup, my neighbors. Hey, guys, this is for you. This is for all my local pickup only. If you are not local pickup, keep scrolling. Just kidding. No. I'm just like, I Keeps, always see that video. I got something I want to say about regular UPS, but she's definitely going to So this it. is just a little, um, just a little, what would I call it? Like a little announcement? Yeah, or? just a little. No, I just want to uh, talk about UPS. You know, that is our local pickup and UPS is so kind and so generous to allow us to have that location as our uh, local pickup yes. spot. They are not affiliated with you uh, with Flash Custom Transfers. They don't know anything about your orders. They don't even know your order number. They don't know anything about Flash Custom Transfers. They only know to uh, hand out our transfers. Yeah. Somebody asked today too about a drop off. Yeah, I got the email. Okay. That guy, he came early. Okay. So I was Here like, it's after 1 p.m. So uh, we've been having, we actually have one, we had one issue at UPS. So I just, that's really what this is about. I wanted to talk to you guys just so one person doesn't mess it up for everybody. One bad apple will ruin the whole butt batch. I think yeah. that's how it goes. Uh, so, you know, they came, when I send you the instructions, it is, you know, we give you specific times when your order will be there. So you have to be sure to get there between those times so UPS doesn't close. We did have one incident. Um, a customer came a little late and they were, you know, they drove, uh, I think about 40 minutes. They got there, the store was closing. Um, they got upset. They were, uh, you know, saying I drove far, I should be able to get my transfers. And it was just a big commotion. It scared the UPS ladies. They were uncomfortable. They didn't feel safe. It was a whole incident. And, you know, I have to take that responsibility as the business owner, um, just to show my regards and my apologies to let them know we, that will never happen again because you know that is your pickup location for you guys's order so if we we ruin you know <laughs> if we don't uh, cherish that relationship with our local ups there will be no local pickup and then everybody has to pay shipping so please be kind to our us uh, our uh, ups ladies please be respectful to the times please re be respectful to them and remember that they do not know anything about your order um, always contact and email us at order now at flash custom transfers.com if you have any regards or any um, questions. questions comments or concerns about the pickup location. So I love you and I'm glad that we're able to provide this, but let's cherish it and um, just treat it with the utmost respect because yeah. they don't have to do that. They don't have to allow us and they do and we appreciate them. So yeah. shout out to the UPS ladies. We love y'all and all our local pickups. Be kind to them. That's yeah. all I have to say. And just to kind of piggyback off of that. Well, before I go into that, because I do want to touch on that and then the regular UPS, just want to send a huge shout out to Darian Sharp. Hopefully I'm pronouncing your name right. I'll put his link in the description down to his YouTube page. Uh, it's a young kid, a really young kid. He's actually a beekeeper. I did a lot of research on your on your page, Darian. So I just wanted to shout him out because he emailed me. He was like, hey, 
hey, I love your videos. I actually bought your transfers and it's is um I think it was like autism awareness. Was it autism awareness or oh, um, dyslexia? It was uh -huh. dyslexia. Remember, it was like mirrored. Oh Remember? yeah, oh the kid. Yeah, the kid. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. The kid. So. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Dyslexia is very close to our family. So when he made the merch and it was really cool, really nice. He had a, he had a the thing on the side. This, what's it called? What's this called? A sleeve. The sleeve patch, but the sleeve hit. He had a sleeve hit. He had the front hit. It was it was really cool to see this young gentleman designing and then to be a beekeeper at that. I was like, I don't know how to, because I went down your whole YouTube, man. And he, he's, he's been a, filming for years. Yeah. He's been filming since he's a little kid. So he's like a young teenager now. He's like growing up and stuff like that. But that's what we always tell people is to continue to film, 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 film. So I like that he's hardworking. He's, you know, he he's a beekeeper. He's in school. And then he's now doing his own merch line. So I just really wanted to say huge shout out to Darian Sharp. Again, I'm going to put his information down below. Please, everybody go out there. Go check out his channel. Go hit that subscribe button. Let's get him, you know, a thousand more subscribers so that he can start and get his watch time up so that mm. he can start being paid from YouTube. I hope that I can help him do that. Again, as a young kid that reached out and the reason why I definitely wanted to do it is because we reached out to Big B TV. He was the first YouTuber that we've seen randomly. We, I seen his car at a restaurant mm -hmm. and I reached out to him on multiple videos and now we're like really close friends to this day. So I just wanted to, you know, hopefully I can give the same energy that got me started or that got us, you know, some help in the YouTube community because we were able to make merch for him. Yeah. And then I kind of got us in the scene. And then from there, we were accepted because people knew that we made merch and stuff like that. So it was able to help elevate our business. So I hope this shout out to you, Mr. Darian Sharp and your family helps you and your business, you know, go to the moon or whatever else that you're doing, man. Thank you for uh, reaching out to us. Anybody else that reaches out, I will definitely look to you know, try to shout you out in our videos, which we do with Basement 215. Mm -hmm. I forgot the other girl out there in Philly. We try to, um, what's the dude, what's the young kid that did the shirts? Mr. Woods. Shout Mr. out Mr. Woods. Woods. Mr. Woods. <laughs> shout Who's out Mr. Woods. the other kid? Uh, uh, Jose. Shout out to Jose with the stretch. We remember the we stretch. We have a lot yeah, of loyal little Who's the kid with flashing. the glasses? The kid with the glasses. He got his, he got his own transfers. Aaron? No, nah, not Aaron. Shout, shout out to out Aaron. Aaron. No, Aaron don't got glasses. Oh, the kid with the glasses. Give me some. His else. his intro starts on like a TV, like, and he'd be standing in front of the wall. Oh my God, he's gonna be mad. I don't know who you're talking about. Oh. What does his designs look like? Oh, not his design. Remember he remember he was using our transfers, then he got his own, started making his own. I'm I am i am really horrible with names, but I can remember faces. He's got like a goatee, brown hair. Glasses. Is it in it basement five one two? No, no, basement five one two. That's the dyslexia. That's the it's basement two one five. <laughs> five one two. That's the. Uh, <laughs> Darian, let me get one of the shirts. Let me get one of the shirts. Yes, yes. Let me <laughs> get one of the shirts. Let me get a shirt, Darian. Yes, That's uh, funny. Yes, yes. Okay, let's move forward. Get anyway, up. yes. I, shout out to him. He's been. He's been. Is it? T-shirt crusaders, I knew it. T-shirt crusaders. Yeah, the crusaders. Oh yeah, yeah. yeah. I see. Yeah. I'm thinking though, the basement guy and him are the same. They're not the same. Yeah. And there's <laughs> a lot of uh, there's a lot of people who support us. Mrs. Estelle. Mrs. There's Stel, tons Stel. of Stel. people that we are help. Yeah. Uh, Miss Sharika, Miss Cami Bell, like so who's many a, people. Who's a young girl? The young girl. Oh, Rochelle. Rochelle. Shout out Rochelle. Yeah. So you know, it, it, we've created this family. We've created this. Uh, I would like to say mentorship as well, yeah. because if they have questions, they can definitely reach out to us and we can help them and just guide them in the right way. Like we needed that guidance when we were first starting, yes. like, what is the next step? Where do I go? How do you know? And then yep. uh, Big B was able to give us little jewels that we actually yes. use now. So if we can just provide little jewels for all of you guys, then, guys, then, then we're doing our, we're doing our duty out here in the community. All right. So let's get back into the list here because I don't want this video to run too long because we're about to jump on live. So just to touch on regular UPS, the, the shipping, whenever, um, and again, U.S. Postal Service, unfortunately, we, again, and we always, it seems like we, we're having to do this periodically, we are not in control of how UPS and the Postal Service handles their shipping. What, so when it doesn't get to you or it gets to you damaged or whatever, just contact us because there is a process to get you a return. But if it does get to you and you do receive it and it's a little damaged and stuff like that, reach out to us because we've printed and we've pressed plenty of items that have looked damaged. 
right? So just we just want it to be very well known that just because it may look damaged or might be beat up a little bit doesn't mean that that's going to affect the way that you that the uh, the way that you press it. So just please reach out to us for that. And again, if your item is lost, we everybody signs a service agreement, so we are not uh, responsible for what happens through UPS. Can issues be resolved? Yes, but at the end of the day, you get you get honey. What is it called? What is you it? You catch honey with bees. <laughs> yes. <laughs> you catch bees with honey. <laughs> yes. You catch it's bees with honey. Result. Like, you're like exactly. Like, if you come in hot, disrespectful, and stuff like that, why would that make any one of us or anybody on our staff want to... Go that extra mile. Go that extra Whenever mile. Whenever you're, you know, kind Hold and... I'm oh, sorry. Go that extra mile outside of our binding contract. That contract that everybody signs, the, the service agreement, is a binding contract between FCD, Vinyl and Apparel, LLC, which is the parent company of Flash Custom Transfers, and you, the customer, right? So everything in there was suggested and templated by Square and then adjusted by us, the company, to put in there the, the specific perimeter. So remember, it's Square, which is our merchant company, which handles all of the financial transactions. Right. And then there's us, so we work directly with Square. And then there's you, the customer. So we're protecting ourselves on the end, on our end, and that contract also protects you on your end as well. So when there's disrespect in certain emails, right? Whenever there's these situations, our team members and ourselves were like, well, this person, we might've went the extra mile for this person. We might've, you know, done whatever. But again, remember, legally, we do not have to. And just let everybody know that that's, you know, it's like, unfortunately, like with like police, like police, you could be speeding and then they, they can let you go. If you're like, hey, officer, man, you know, I was tripping. I'm bugged out, man. Obviously, never admit to speed. <laughs> but I'm just saying, you'd be like, oh, man, was I? Oh, man, I'm super sorry, man. Here's my stuff right here, man. I'm I'm super sorry, man. How's your day going? Da, 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 He can legally give you the ticket. Actually, if you're speeding, he could pull you out, do all types of other stuff, go run through it. Or he could be like, you know what? I appreciate the kindness. This is what I'll do. Just, just slow down. I won't even give you a warning. Just slow down, da 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 I see you got a tail light out. I'm not worried about none of that. I can smell something in the car. I'm not worried about that. You know what I mean? They could do that, right? She's had an incident like that, pretty fun back in the day. Not like that with the drugs in the car. <laughs> but as a, girl, as a girl, she got away with something. It was a very funny story. But that's my point is we want to help people out and stuff like that if situations happen. We don't want to see people lose. Now, if you lose... $200 plus worth or whatever, then yes, we will definitely jump into the process of UPS and getting that back. But again, the return process as far as refunding you your money, and I know I've been long-winded on this, but this is very important. The return process as far as UPS refunding you your money is extremely long. They don't like doing it. It's a very long process. I have to wait for them. You have to file a complaint. I have to wait for them to send me the complaint in, in a piece of, in fact, I'll show you, I'll show them. Okay. It. And we have no control over UPS. I know you guys are like, oh, UPS lost my package, UPS delivered. What can you do? Once it is in the hands of UPS, we have no control. Flash Custom Transfers has no control over how UPS delivers your package. So this is it right here. This is the Flash Custom the Flash Custom Designs. I don't know why. That's our account. So it oh, says, yeah, yeah, ship yeah, no, with UPS. This is our account with UPS. Oh, yeah, okay. it's because it's made. Oh, for, it's old. Yeah, it's we our old account. Yeah, time. we created it a long time ago. We actually didn't change it, so it has all of our information. It comes right here to us. If I don't receive this piece of paper, this is somebody's return. This is somebody that I'm actually helping process to get their thing done. If I don't get this you can't get your return from UPS. So that, and this, they mail this out whenever they feel like it. <laughs> and then I have to go into the account, type in all the information, send it all back to them. And then from there, I have to wait for another piece of paper. Could that piece of paper be a confirmation? Could that piece of paper be a check for you? I don't know, but they take it very slow. I have so many of, so many of these. How many do I have of these? A bunch. 
Uh, that uh, that? They come into the mail. Okay, I guess somebody must have lost their package. Let me go in and do it. Boom, I do it. I keep this for my records. It's all up to them. I think you might have gotten maybe two checks in, maybe. since we started our business. Maybe. And we've had a million of those. So they're not passing them out left and right. It's a lot of work, a lot of paperwork. And we're subject to that after not having any control over the delivering process. So yes. it is a long process. And if you can just give us some grace, uh, we would appreciate that because we don't have any control, but we, yet we do have to handle all the paperwork when it is not delivered on time, correctly damaged, things like that. Yes. Yeah, so it's a lot of behind the scenes with all of that. It's not just, they lost my package, give my money back. Yeah. <laughs> I wish it was that easy. Yeah. I really wish. Good news. Good news? Psych. <laughs> Don't no. me. Come on, baby. Good news. No, I love you, baby. You ruined I'm that. I'm sorry. I was being funny for the camera. Well, your friend's going to get Come you on, in baby. trouble. Your friend. Okay. So, go ahead, Tom. What's the good news? The second one. Oh, you don't really like that one, do you? <laughs> <laughs> good news. No, no, no. This is good news. I had two people email me today, and they were like, what's up? And I'm like, we're going to release the information soon. Shh. UVDTF is coming back. I know yes. you guys have been so patient. I appreciate you and I love you so much. June 1st, we should be releasing all UVDTF products. The uh, Don't hold us to it though. Don't, yeah, yeah. So we're, this is just, this yes. is our, in, our uh, foresight right now for where yes. we at right now on the 18th. By June 1st, we think everything will be up and running, up and going. So that is our deadline of our release date. So it is coming. Just give us a few more weeks. I know the past couple of weeks, we didn't have any answer. We didn't know anything. We were still working on it, but now we have a date June 1st. So uh, yes. stay tuned. Anybody who has previously ordered and has pending orders, those will be fulfilled and moving forward. So thank you guys for being so patient, but it is back. Yes. It will be back. It will be back. And mm -hmm. Just to kind of blend, blend into the next. There was a lot of move, moving pieces. So mm -hmm. we've had moving pieces at the warehouse with the uh, UV machines, DTF machines and stuff like that as we're transitioning to the next part of this video because I think it's almost at 20 minutes. So the next part is the we had a UV machine. It didn't meet its quality. We got rid of it. We had another UV machine. It didn't meet its quality. There were issues with materials and stuff like that. Got rid of it. Now we are on our third UV machine. We're hoping that this one meets its quality. But again, remember that we only want to print to the highest quality. So some things come in, some things come out. It's just what happens in business. And if you want, do you want to touch on the next one? Kind of leading into that. What's the next one? This next one. This one? Yeah, number three. Yeah, as we lead into things coming in, things coming out, things still kind of being there. Okay, so we did make a transition in our business with Flash Custom Transfers. As you all know, we had um, Marianne which was our uh, lead graphic designer, and she was the lead consultant in all of the emails. No longer on payroll. Yes, she no is. Longer on yeah, we, um, with everything going on within the company, with everything shifting in the economy, with everything going on in the world of 2023, the best case, the best solution yes. to just stay afloat and to stay um, well, efficient with efficient our business with and prepare for what could happen with the yeah. recession and everything that could be. So coming. we were, uh, so we did. Uh, we moved forward with Megan Marianne. PRN. PRN. She's still with the company, but she's no longer on payroll. Yes. So if you've noticed any price differences and any quotes that we give you, it's because you are paying her specific rate. Yeah. So she is contracted. So we contract her um, to handle all of our graphics, embroidery effects, uh, anything graphic designing and anything like that. So we yes. utilize her for all of that. She is no longer um, subject to all emails. Yes. I handle all emails. I handle all of those invoices, things like that. She is solely contracted for graphic designing. So she's still a part of the team. She still will be making and vectoring all your images. She's just no longer on the email. Yes, no longer on the emails. Mm -hmm. And she has her own entity now. She's no longer subject to being under flash custom transfers. Yeah, yeah. So like I said, we contract her. She has her own- She's a free um, agent. Free agent, freelance yes. agent. Yeah, yep. so we are using her for her services. So. Yes, and it's been like that for a while. We didn't announce it when it happened. It's been like that for what, over a month uh, now? Over a month, yeah, probably over a, a month, month and a half now. Yep, mm -hmm. so you guys, I mean, maybe you guys have seen things or maybe you guys have noticed, maybe you haven't. Um, but, you know, and again, these are things that we, these are decisions that we have to make and 
every business has to make, you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. What's called layoffs or firing or whatever, adjusting to prepare for what could come. Sales dip and go up and down, like I said, and it really affects us whenever sales might not be that strong. And then, you know, printers go down or-, or UVDTF, UV our, you know, one of our main stars of the show goes down yes. and then it affects the business and then uh, the price of all of those um, printers yes. and- parts and labor and it, it's a lot yes so owning a business it's not you know yeah it's very butterflies and cupcakes there's serious yeah. business behind it and yep. um doing that adjustment with marion was a very big decision for our company yes. and very hard decision because we wanted her to know that this wasn't based off of her performance she no. was an amazing uh part of the team every day we've learned so much from her and still are uh, but it's just a decision that had to be made. And she understood. So it wasn't any, you know, bad blood or mm -hmm. uh, upsetness. She understood. She understood. She knows what goes on within the company behind yes. the scenes. And so she she was understanding to that and still allowed us to contract her and use her for PRN. So we yes. appreciate that so much. Yep. And that leads us into our next subject where we have... And a lot of you have received it and you're going to get renew emails <laughs> about pressing instructions. Um, we have new film and new ink. So for DTF. For DTF. So you will see as we, like I said, we in the last 30 days, there's been just a huge shift that we've had to make from content. That's what you see us a lot out with different businesses as we're transitioning Flash Custom Transfers. We're about to get out live here soon. We are transitioning Flash Custom Transfers into being more of not not mentor type business, but more of a business that helps other businesses grow. So mm -hmm. the same way we entered um, the, the Wing Zone and Miss Kelly and the uh, CBD Shaman in which we got the contract for the CBD Shaman, we are also uh, expanding and we will be showing videos here soon of how we're, how we take like businesses which are like small, you know, might look a certain way and then we revamp them and stuff like that. Mm -hmm. Like we, like what we plan to do with a Phaser's Barbershop and whoever other companies that we come across. So it, it is gonna change a little bit more on the content. We will still post the, the stuff, but all of that trickled down to our own business in which Shelly can also attest to here is now you will see a brand new film. So don't be alarmed. Everything is still the same, still cold peel, still second press, da, 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 da. But there are some flexibilities that you can do if mm -hmm. you choose to with our new product. So it's way more vibrant. It should have a softer feel. And again, we need you guys to give us your feedback on the new product. But we definitely took a step back and decided to kind of elevate the product that we already have on the market because there's a lot of people out there, a lot of competitors, yeah, 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 what the, what the, <laughs> hold on, hold on, what is it called? It is a lot of competitors, you know, you may know them, they come out at night and they have stars, and they have stars, I don't know, they sling stars at night sometimes, you know what I mean? Anyway, there's a lot of competitors out there, and we just want to stay ahead of the game, we just want to stay, you know. As you should, yeah. as in any business and any, um, any uh, category, you always want to be ahead of the game with your competitor, be innovative, yes. stand out. Everything that we've taught, we're, we're having to implement that now yes. and you guys are witnessing it. So it's good to see uh, you grow with the company. Some of you guys have been here since we had our retail, since before we had our retail. Yeah. And you retail know, store. retail store. So you guys are growing with the company and you're Not just watching us. Huh? Never what honest. what is it? What, why you keep interrupting? I'm being silly. I'm being silly right now. <laughs> uh, yeah, I forgot what I was saying. No, you said that they were here with us before, mm. and these are the things that we have to do in order to grow. Keep going. That's it. Baby, don't stop just because I'll be messing with you. Baby, this is do what I doing. interrupt you while you're saying all your important things? If no. you did, though, it would be mad funny. But I'm responsible. I'm sorry. And I won't. I'm sorry, baby. Okay. You want to go ahead? I don't. <laughs> Come on. Anyway, guys, listen. So I know this video is long. We're about to get on. Um, I know. It's like almost an hour. I know. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. We're about to get on live right now. So check out our live and where we're going to talk about more, all the uh, the bigger list of things that we have going on. We just want to touch on that because we also want to touch on wholesale and some other things. Is something you want to read real quick? No, I was uploading this to let everybody know we're about to go on live. Okay. But it's not uploading. Okay. Well, we're about to go live right now. So guys, go check out. Meet us there. Yeah. Go, go meet us on the live and hopefully... Well, actually, this video oh, won't yeah. be up before the live. They won't. They can't meet us there. Yes, they we're can. gonna live, and then you're gonna. You still have to edit it and then put it out. Yeah, you want me to edit it and put it out? Or just go live. 
No, we're about to go live. Oh, right, we're about it's to go live. It's over to be four. All right, guys, be basic. Peace. Sorry, so long-winded. We got so much to say. Love y'all. Bye. Ah!